No, come on. That's silly. Godslayer's great sword, sick. Gravel stone, what's that what's that all about? Okay, judging by this, it looks like I probably have two more torches to light. Just a hunch. I don't know. I don't remember if these other ones were lit before or not. But yeah, let's see if we can find two more torches. Yeah, I didn't realize what I was supposed to do, so there's a torch up here. Let's see if that made a difference. Yeah, it did. There's now four lit on that side, so we just need one more light. Gotta find one more light somewhere. Okay.
nice. Here's the last one. There we go, now all the torches are lit up. That looks so mysterious and mystical, I fucking love it. I feel like I'm going to some temple. I guess it is kind of a temple. Okay, this guy was just straight up dead before. Stuff going on here now. Whoa. Okay, big boss fog wall. The moose. Ouch, holy shit, that's powerful. Okay, nice, I can do a lot of damage too. I don't know why that first attack was so powerful. It burst through my immunity bubble and then did half my damage and then every attack after that was kind of weak. Nice, the Ancestor Spirit Trophy earned and the Ancestral, ancestral Follower Ashes. Beautiful. Yeah, he was a little bit more bark than bite there. Came in really strong and then it was pretty easy after that. Hmm, just like underneath the lake in some random cave. That's a wicked view. I love that. Oh, is this Blythe? Nice. We've been looking for you, bud. Ah. Good to see you. Apologies, mate. I don't have much to report. I can see bloody Nokron right above me. But I'm not... Sorry. Gotta deal with these assholes first, apparently. Alright, as you were saying, Blood. Ah. Oh. Good to see you. Apologies, mate. But I don't have much to report. I can see bloody Nokron right above me. But I'm absolutely stumped. I've tried all the gateways, to no avail. 
Perhaps it's time to ask Celebus. I recall that spiteful little rat acting like he knew something. Let's give him a squeeze. Show him just how sharp my teeth are. Nice, Blythe doesn't like Celebus either. That's good. Interesting, could I get over to Nocron? With some horse jumping, perhaps? No, it doesn't look like it. Take this treasure, though. Stone Sword Key, sick. This is where I fought a Crucible Knight naked with my dagger. A little while ago, right on that bridge right there. So yeah, we can't quite get up there now. No, come on! That was silly. So here's that item. I jest. I wouldn't go that far. Besides, uh, I should check on some things here. Leave this place to me. You just do what you feel is right. If either of us learns anything, we tell the other. Right? And if we reach a dead end, I suppose we go back to the source. Okay, yeah. Celebus rarely gives a straight answer. The first time. I think it was up here. Yes, it was. Ooh, an item too. Nice. Let's see what's through this portal. That wasn't very exciting. Oracular bubble. Nice. Oh, okay, that's the big power-up move that those guys use. They have like little bubbles and small bubbles, so that's the big one. Or <laughs> big bubbles and small bubbles. Somber Smith and Stone 5. Nice. I've been fucking waiting for one of those for so long. That's amazing. That's going to be a tough choice, what I use it on.
Mm. Yes, just the horse couldn't get through. Well, that's a cool waterfall. Oh, I didn't realize it, but that's what it must have done. It brought me up to an area that I can't normally get to. That portal that I took. Yeah, I think this might be a new area. And here's a crazy fight, looks like. Yep. Damn it, man. I just want to fucking use my power up. I feel like every time I've used that recently, I get hit immediately after. It's so frustrating. Go to hell. I would love to crit him for the win, but I'll just do this. Dragon Halberd, nice. Marika's Scar Seal. Doesn't seem like there's, there's enough water in this reservoir up here to create this much of a waterfall. But hey, what do I know? It was worth coming back here just for that Ghost Glove Wart 5. About no crime, well, here we go. Well, you're asking me about that, are you? The task was left to you and the mongrel, was it not? Not only are you incompetent, but shameless to boot. Well, there's no helping it. Now's as good a time as any. I'll let you in on it. There's a glintstone sorcerer by the name of Selen in Limgrave. Hmm. She owes me for the help I gave her when she was expelled from the academy. I asked her to look into the matter some time ago. I'll write you a letter of introduction. Go ask her. Sylvis's introduction, okay. There you are, my apprentice. Shall we commence the lesson? Well, well. Sylvis is not a name I ever wanted to hear again. But fine. If it will help you, my apprentice. I offer my knowledge. The stars alter the fate of the Karian royal family and the fate of your mistress, Rani. But long ago, General Radan challenged the swirling constellations and in a crushing victory, arrested their cycles. Now he is the force that repulses the stars. If 
General Radan were to die, the stars would resume their movement, and so too would Rani's destiny. Oh, General Radan is going to die. No question about it. Might have been... Yeah, yeah, here we go. Witchbane Ruins, Sorceress Selene. I don't know why there's two of her, and why this one is able to speak to me fluently while the other one is babbling and locked to a wall. It'll do no good, I swear it. And yet you persist, you frothing degenerates. That guy was wearing Silver's hat. Yeah, I don't know. It's very strange. <laughs> What's that? You want another puppet? Quite the keen paramour, aren't we? But I'm afraid each and every one is like a child to me. I can hardly just give them away. Oh dear, what's to be done? Why don't you fetch me some starlight shards? If you can manage it, I'll gladly prepare a new puppet for you. The soul of every puppet has its own ambience. You'll soon come to know once you possess a few. And once each's predilections are known to you, the better you will be able to love them. Oh yes, you have much to look forward to further down this road. So I've got Starlight Shards. I haven't used any. I've been collecting them. Ooh, nice. I took this one and it's more expensive, which means I get this one for only two Starlight Shards, so I made the right call. And I still have two Starlight Shards left. Beautiful. You're proving to be quite the puppeteer. I've not had an apprentice for a very long time indeed. About the scheme. Okay, let's see. Perhaps you'll be interested in a little scheme of mine. It will produce the finest of puppets, which I aspire to cherish with these very hands. A ploy to fool even Lady Rani. Hmm. How does that sound? This guy's a troublemaker. I knew I had you pegged. You're just like me. Then I'd like you to procure something. A rather unique starlight shard that glistens with amber. With that, my special draft will gleam with nectar sweetness. And even a demigod would be slave to its charms. Procure it for me. The rather unique starlight shard that glistens with amber. With that, my special dream. And even a demigod. Where do I get it, though? I guess I'll have to find that out on my own. Okay. I still don't know how to get into Nokron. Try to go to talk to Blight again, I guess. Pretty hilarious that you can summon your horse in this tower. Okay, so Ronnie's just kind of waiting. Ah, well met. What news? Hmm. So Ronnie's fate is kept in stasis by Stars Curse for Dawn. That reminds me of something I heard. There's a festival being held at the castle on the southern edge of the Caled Wilds, east of Limgrave. It's a festival of combat, and I heard that you can fight Radan himself. He who's once called the strongest of all the demigods. Maybe it's just a coincidence, but I think it's worth investigating. I'll be on my way to this festival of Radan then. That's kind of cool. I was already planning on going into Kaled to do more stuff there, so this works out well. You're coming too, right? To Radan's festivities. Of course. To the main castle in Caled. The way ahead is pleasingly simple. We fight, sword, and fang. <laughs> All right, cool. I guess that wraps up our business down here for now. Let's go back to the round table hold and reevaluate our character. I'm gonna like reassess my character build a little bit, and also see if any of the NPCs at the 
Roundtable hold have anything new to say? 